like, yeah, like that lady's looking at me right now. She just gave me a weird look. That's fine. I don't know her. Morning, future me. Today, I'm going to Berlin. This is a little trip I booked myself a while ago. I didn't at the time think I would still be doing PB, but it's worked out quite nicely. It's also come at a pretty good time, a point where I want to clear my head. I deleted Twitter and Instagram and Snapchat temporarily off my phone so that I'm not even tempted while I'm over there. I am going to be filming this, of course, but I won't be posting and interacting. And I'm going to fly over today, I'm going to check in, I'm going to find myself a nice meal, and then I'm going to have a full day to go to an exhibition and explore the city. And then I'll have a morning and maybe a lunch before I have to head back to the airport. I think it's going to be real good. Uh, in order for it to be real good, though, I have to immediately go shower and head out uh, and get a bus because it's a Sunday. And apparently getting to Gatwick Airport on a Sunday is really freaking difficult. This is my first time traveling to Gatwick on a coach. Honestly, it's pretty good. It's nice and warm, it's comfy, there's space to spread out. That was just lovely. <laughs> Onward. I'm in. 12 10. What do I do? I am like two whole hours. Once again, I find myself hanksing, but at least this time, it's positive hanksing. This is positive hanksing. This is, I'm hanksing because I'm early. I'm hanksing because I was well prepared. Just landed in Berlin. Really quick at security. Aha, uh -huh. yeah, still very cold. I'm gonna eat so much done first. So I just arrived. Damn! Damn! That was the smoothest international trip I've had in years. That's been the best journey. Everything went absolutely fine! I landed, I understood where to go, I used Google Maps, I didn't have to tell my bank anything, I didn't have to tell my mobile network anything. That's amazing, I'm amazed. Amazed! I wonder if the coffee's free. If the coffee's free. We're gonna have a problem. So it's now quarter past five. I wanna try and explore a little bit. I'm in uh, the Alexanderplatz area of Berlin and I want to just do a bit of evening walking. And although I know it actively works against almost all of my long-term goals, there is something I need to do. Hey man, you got a minute to talk? Yeah, of course, what's up? Get in there. Yeah. Go. Keep going. I find myself in a foreign country and I am getting hungry. What is the priority place that I need to go and, and get food from? Yeah. Keep going. Zoom. Yeah, digital. Yeah, digital. Zoom. Yeah. Keep going. Oh, yeah. Yes. Make Geo proud! I got the chicken wings. I got the fries. I got the roasty sticks. I got the gazer giftful. And I got the big roasty. May Poseidon have mercy on my soul. Got all my essential supplies. I've got pen, charge cable, spare battery, and I've got my incredibly detailed itinerary. I need to hit up an ATM and get some breakfast. Ugh, it's freezing! Pro Strat orange wake up juice. Get. Now I gotta get on the underground. This doesn't feel like the setting of a beautiful historic castle. It feels like a car dealership. Oh wait, there it is. I found it! This guy. This is what I came for. It's probably really naive and derivative, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna look the pants at it. I'm gonna look it till it's been looked. Wow, this place is huge. Working off 
at McDonald's. At least I can say I've seen all of Berlin now. Okay, I'm going down now. I think I found it, so I'll see you when I come out. Yeah, it was all right. Some of those pieces made me feel things. Uh, a lot of it was really on the nose. He has a lot of opinions about things. He clearly has a lot of feelings about America. It's just a little unsubtle for my tastes. But then again, you know, activism isn't subtle. Raising awareness isn't about being subtle. It's about making it very obvious. It's about saying what you want to say. So it's just not my scene. TLDR, come for the mediocre neo-expressionism. Stay for the mind-blowing medieval fortress. Time for McDonald's. I'm kidding. I'm joking. Calm down. The U-trains here make a kind of space age like sound when they arrive. I love it. There it is. I don't really know what I was expecting, but damn Geo, we got to come back here and do the Checkpoint Charlie McDonald's. There's something very big and sparse about this city, particularly when you compare it to London. I can't decide whether it's refreshing or sad, but I'm letting my mind wander. I think it's doing me good. Oh my goodness. I think the back of this museum is more exciting to me than the front. Oh, it's beautiful. This is some next level, next level shit. That's the real modern art right there. Oh, hey, little astronauts. Oh, hang about. I can do something here. P. B. Where are you? Show yourself. <gasps> F. B. Okay, I can go in now. I got a couple hours left uh, before things start closing. I'm heading to this chocolate shop now, and then I'm gonna get me some curry burst. kid in a candy store back there. Who's gonna help me eat these? I guess no one. Forward unto Currywurst. I finally found the center of Berlin, I think. This is the most city, touristy it's felt all day. How did I manage to like circumnavigate this entire area? The good, good curry boys are right next to the Nike store. I'm not gonna, what are you doing to me? I'm not going in, I'm not going in, I'm not going in. Yes. Yes. I destroyed that curry burst. That was amazing. So what have we learned from all of this? I definitely think by the time I land back in the UK, I will have shaken whatever weird funk got a hold of me last weekend. I've been in this city for over 24 hours now. I am caffeine free. I, I mean, it's only five, but I will be alcohol free. I can tell you that over the course of the day, I haven't listened to any music. I haven't, uh, you know, I haven't plugged into my headphones the way that I would in London. I've just sat with the silence and sat on public transit and, and watched people and made eye contact and smiled. And over the course of the day, I have felt my mood improve. This morning, I was a little, sh I was feeling shy. That's what I was feeling. To the point where I wasn't, you know, I wasn't talking to the camera that much. I wasn't like walk doing this in public because I didn't feel confident when I arrived here. So I just lay low and I pointed the camera at other things and when I did speak into the camera, I did it like when no one was around or like not too loudly. At some point though, around an hour ago when I was leaving the Modern Art Museum, I didn't feel like that anymore. I didn't feel self-conscious in that way anymore. It's really hard to describe, but like, yeah, like that lady's looking at me right now. She just gave me a weird look. That's fine. I don't know her. I couldn't do that this morning. And now I can, but I think it means that 
this trip was a success. I'm gonna put the camera down now. I'm gonna enjoy the rest of the evening camera free. I'm gonna get up tomorrow and I'm gonna have a nice quiet breakfast and make my way to the airport. Thank you for watching this. Thank you for contributing to the Kickstarter, which is still going on or should still be going on. And I hope you all have checked it out and considered backing. Future being, I hope you're feeling good, okay? Because I'm feeling good, gooder than I was. Berlin has been restorative in some ways.